Hello everyone and welcome back. So today we're going to do Tesco again. See how that's changed. If it's changed, the price has certainly changed, that's for sure. Um, when we first started testing this, it was back in December. E10 back then was 142.9. Now it's 160.9. And back in December, the Momentum 99 E5 was 149.9. And that's now 167.9. So to do the test, we add 20 mils of dyed blue water into the bottom of each measuring jug, which is at the marker. Then we add 200 mils of fuel into each jug. We give them a good shake up and we'll let them settle for a good half an hour, an hour. And then we come back and we review what's there. So yeah, let's get going. I'll add the fuels in and we'll take it from there. There we are, all loaded up. So the one on the left, that's E10, just standard normal fuel. Uh, and the one on the right, that's Momentum 99, E5. I can see straight away that the E10 is creeping up. Um, and the reason that that happens is that the ethanol is hydroscopic, so it absorbs the water and they're attracted to each other. So if you get any water in your tank, this is what happens, it separates, you're going to end up with problems, especially in a classic car or a classic bike or anything like that. Uh, never mind the corrosion side of it. So what I'll do now is I'll, uh, I'll give these a good shake up, I'll agitate them and we'll leave them for a while and we'll come back and see exactly what's left. Right, so we've done that, we've let it settle. Bad news if you use Tesco this has got more ethanol than last time so that e10 on the left that is now at seven and a half percent so as you can see it's gone up three clicks uh two and a half percent increments seven and a half percent and the momentum 99 which was two and a half percent last time is now at five percent so if you are bothered about using ethanol and you use tesco well, the choice is yours. That's all I'm going to say. There's other stuff out there which has less. It might be a little bit more money, but it depends on how, uh, how precious you are about your vehicle or whatever it is that you're putting this fuel into. So, I have a couple more fuels left, uh, well, ready to go. Um, I can't do them now, but I will do them over the coming days. I've got some apple green because people ask for that, and I've got some jet because also people ask for that as well uh, no idea what they're going to be like the jet was super expensive that is the most expensive fuel i have bought yet um so i i hope it's brilliant um but we'll wait and see so thank you for watching and uh, i hope you've enjoyed it and you've found it useful so i'll be back in a few days see ya